It happened here at the main building at Algonquin College last month where a man walked in with some yellow paint and a mop and vandalized the mural behind me. Now this man was identified by security cameras as a non-Indigenous student here at the college and has since been arrested and charged with a hate crime. But the incident left Indigenous students angry and hurt. Andrea Bonzewin, Director of Indigenous Initiatives, says that the entire community was affected here at the college. For our, for our students, it's hard to, for them to continue to be strong when uh, things like the vandalism to the mural happens and it's just another setback into their emotions and, their, um, and it affects their work here. Because they're far from home, we have something here for them and then it gets um, destroyed or vandalized and they, they feel it, they feel the pain. The mural is an Indigenous design depicting creation stories and other important aspects of Indigenous culture. It was painted by husband and wife artist team Clandestino, but the design came from hours of consultation with Indigenous knowledge keepers and students. We were listening to what the college wanted and the community wanted to represent. So this is how the image came out. We came out with about five different images and then it got narrowed down, narrowed down, and we kind of mixed a couple together to form this last one, which has a multi-layered theme about a lot of different representations. So every little thing that's on the mural has a very deep uh, meaning to the college and to the people who were behind the creation of it. The actual painting of the mural took two weeks. Repairing it took two days. Now the students here at Algonquin College will be returning to classes now from their reading week, and the college hopes that the experience of everyone coming together to fix this situation will make their college community stronger. Jamie Pashagumskum, APTN National News, Ottawa.